I was always like drawing as a kid. Like my mother is a very, very artistic person. So I grew up with just canvases, paints, everything all around me. And I got into music. Then I decided I wanted to eat, so I had to make money. And I decided to pursue a, a career in computer information systems. I was a programmer, um, I was head of IT, and uh, all general IT nerd stuff. So I got back into drawing at about 28 years old, I think. And it was really initially just a creative outlet for me. The people who were following me online, they're like, why aren't you doing your own comic? And then I was like, well, why aren't I just doing my own comic? You know, you can self-publish your own comic or you can put it online to read and there's all different websites for that. So why don't I try that for an original title? Let's Play is about a young woman who is an indie game developer, Sam Young. Uh, she uh, created a game called Ruminate. And there is a individual, his name is Marshall Law. He's an internet personality. And he plays her game gives it a bad review, ruined her reputation and her developer score, and kind of a mob mentality went after her. And by the end of the first chapter, we find out that uh, Marshall is moving into the apartment next door. So in my story, Let's Play, there are these things called emoticons. And they are personifications of different emotional states. All of the characters of Let's Play are like those emoticons for me. Sam is my social anxiety, my fear of confrontation, my awkwardness. Marshall is my, the days that I'm depressed. He's my want and desire to make everybody like you. And Angela is my fiery side. So all the characters are different aspects of my personality. So when I write them, I think to myself, if I was to take that part of my personality and turn it as high as it'll go, what would it manifest as? And that's these characters. So like if Sam was a self-insert of myself and somebody's like, I don't like Sam because I think she's stupid. And then you're like, I'm not stupid. You know, and so it, you kind of run that risk. But to say that Sam is like a personification of a side of me, I'm like, yeah, maybe she is stupid. <laughs> that's entirely possible. <laughs> My experiences at the cons I've been to have been great. It just kind of blew my mind that these people actually like wanted to meet me and they wanted my autograph. I'm more than happy to sign anything, but I was just like, but why? <laughs> like, I'm just a, I'm, I'm just a goober. Like, why do you want my autograph? Overall, I think one of my biggest prides with the creative process of Let's Play has been creating a character that so many people can relate to. That would be Sam. So many people contact me and they're just like, that's me, she's me, I'm her. I always say I want my readers to, to feel things and I want people to understand the serious aspects of my comic, but ultimately I really just want people to laugh. <laughs>